Hey guys, it's Miss Sophie coming to do a quick review on um, some things that I have purchased. Um, I'm going to start by reviewing some small things from Louis Vuitton that I've bought. One of them being that, um, or two of them being this luggage tag. I purchased this. I've wanted the red luggage tag since forever and um, finally decided to go ahead and get this and I was able to find it. The sales associates here in my area kept acting as if they didn't know or have any ideas to what I was talking about when I said that I wanted to purchase the red luggage tag. I actually called on my own to another store that was not far from me and found this. I was also able to get a key bell because I get so tired of having this lock on my speedy. Um, it's probably some of you speedy owners know and they don't come with key bells so you don't have anything to put your key in plus I thought this would be a good opportunity to be original personalize my bag so I just have one initial on my tag and one initial on my key bell and I'm actually doing something a little different side note I'm actually filming on my 6 plus instead of my iPad because I know the camera is really good on the 6 Plus. The next thing I got is this wallet. It's the Emily wallet in the Epi Leather. And um, it's this color is called the, um, what is this called? Mimosa. So I got this and it has the silver hardware. And it has, of course, as you all know, the four card slots. It has a big compartment here, compartment for change, which I do have change in there right now. And it has a big pocket in the back. So I'm sorry the lighting sucks. It is nighttime right now, so I don't have the best lighting. Um, but this color, I'll try to direct it to the light. It is absolutely gorgeous in person. Um, I am a little pissed off because I did notice some imperfections in the wallet. And mind you, this is my third wallet. Um, simply because um, the first one... I took it to get it hot stamped and it got ruined instead. Um, so those, for those that want to hot stamp um, Epi, you might not even want to bother. Um, I went to hot stamp this and I actually was getting my initial right here and like I said it got ruined. Um, I don't know if he came down too hard with the pressure of the stamp. I don't know. I have no idea. But um, it was not good. Um, it actually burned the wallet. It burned through it. And then you can actually see um, a silhouette of the H even from the outside. I was very surprised. Epi is supposed to be very, very durable. So I couldn't really understand why that happened. He ordered me another wallet. Um, the bar the crease on the sides right here was indented so hard that when I ran my finger across it, the material felt like it was raised. Um, so I wasn't happy about that. So he ordered me another one, which is now this one. I'm not the happiest with this one either, but I'm just kind of over it. I'm tired of running back and forth. The location, you know, this it's it's not just up the street for me. I have to plan a trip. I have to go out there. It's at Saks. They close early. They have these crazy hours where they close at like six or seven o'clock. I don't leave my office till five. And I have to commute and drive out there um, at least about 20 minutes and that's with no traffic so if I hit traffic you know I'm in trouble so I'm kind of over it I'm just gonna 
I guess settle and just deal with this one um, but there's a lot of in to me I mean I'm very anal and you spend this kind of money on stuff you expect for it to be perfect so there's a lot of imperfections that I'm noticing on this uh, like I said I'm not quite happy with but whatever so as far as this is concerned though I do have the 6 plus and it does fit inside I'm filming on it but let me see if I can grab a case so I can show you how it fits So this is the case for the 6 Plus, and if you stick it in here, let me just take my money out. So as you can see, with it in there with the case, it does fit well, and it will close. So just put it in there like that. It will close with no problems. All right, so that is that. So for anybody who has like the newer phones, if you were wondering if it would fit, it does indeed fit. All right, so that is my review. Have a good night.